I'm Lindsay Baumgren of Nourish Move Love, and this is your Dumbbell Leg Day. If you love at-home workouts, hit subscribe to our YouTube channel, or better yet, click that join button and become part of our YouTube community for more accountability and support. All right, you guys, it's an extra special day at NML because I've got some friends on the mat with me today. We are excited to partner with the Minnesota Pork Board for today's workout. You guys all know and love this face right here. We've got guys. Dr. Taylor joining us again. Go ahead, introduce yourself, Taylor. Good to be back. Um, if you're a new timer here at NML, um, my name is Taylor Spronk. I'm a, veter I'm a pig veterinarian from Southwest Minnesota and I'm married to a pig farmer. Yes, and we love Dr. Taylor and her fun pork facts. She is just crushing it in the field every day, hanging out with pig farmers. Yep. Making sure the pigs are healthy. Yep. That's basically yeah. the summarization of your job, right? Yeah. Am uh -huh. I good? Okay, I'm yeah. good. All right, and we got a new face with us today. This is Haley. Haley is a student going to school, and tell us what you're going to school for. I'm studying bacterial diseases in swine, um, focused on lameness in swine. She is on the preventative side of keeping the pigs healthy. Is yes. that correct? Correct. Preventative side of keeping the pigs healthy, so she can relay her information to Taylor and they can keep all the pigs healthy. So we can get at home pork right in our kitchen, at the grocery store, to our table. We get lean cuts of pork because that is a great source of protein, of vitamins and minerals, a great way to feed our family, a very affordable way to feed our family as well. So we love pork. We're all about some lean cuts of pork. We'll talk about what are my favorite lean cuts of pork as well as these ladies can weigh in on pork and how it's raised and, and hanging out with the farmers and what that's actually like, getting it from farm to table. So excited to jump in today's leg day with you. All you are gonna need is some dumbbells today. I have anywhere from 15 to 20 pounds for today's leg day. Use whatever you have. You can always drop your weights at any point in time. Today's workout looks like this. You got four circuits. Each circuit has three moves. We go isolated exercise, isolated exercise. Move three is a combination of the previous two moves. You do it for 30 seconds of work followed by 15 seconds of rest times two. And then we've got a fun 30 second power move to pick it up a notch <laughs> in between circuits. I know these guys are pumped for the power move. Yes. The power move. All right, let's get ourselves warmed up so we can jump into today's leg day. So we're gonna start feet shoulder width distance apart. We're gonna go right into a squat, into a knee hug. So pull that right knee up. Squat, left knee comes up. Give it a little hug. Squat, right knee up. Giving you to uh, get low in those squats as well as transfer your weight from side to side. Good warm up here. Pull it up, stretch that glute as you pull that leg up. Nice, give it a little hug hug. A little tug tug. Nice, challenge your balance and your core right out of the gate today. Nice work, you guys. We are gonna hit lower body leg day. We love a good dumbbell leg workout. Nice, give me two more, two more. Nice work. Last one, last one. Oh, nice, now you can take those hands right to your hips. We're gonna go one hip hinge, push the hips back, stand tall, one calf raise, up to the balls of the feet, roll it back. Hinge back, roll up. Push the hips back and roll up. Nice, we are warming up the hammies, the glutes, the low back, and then we're hitting the calves and ankles. Hammies, glutes, low back. Calves and ankles, right there. Two more, two more, push it back. Roll it up, nice, last one. Push it back, roll it up. Let's go right into step back lunges. Right leg goes back, drive up. Left leg goes back, drive up. Some step back lunges. Nice work, just dropping that back knee towards the ground and then always driving through that front heel. Drive through that heel, nice. Drive through that heel, you got it. Nice, stepping back to train tracks, not a tight rope. Nice stable balance. Nice strong legs, right there. Go four, you got it. Three, nice work. Two, and one. We're just gonna hit our knees right here. Hit the ground right here. Nice little tabletop cat-cow action. Drop the belly, lift the chin, reverse it. Tuck the chin up towards the ceiling, spine to chest, spine to chest, chin to chest. Find a nice neutral spine right here. Nice work, you guys. Step back, find a high plank for me. Step the right foot outside the right hand. Nice, easy twist, this should feel really good. Drop your elbow down towards your calf, shin, ankle area. We're gonna open up those hips right here so you get deeper squats, better lunges. Open it back up, set it down and switch it out. Left foot steps outside, left hand, easy twist. Nice work, from here lower that elbow down towards the calf, shin, ankle, shoe. Open it back up, set it down. One more time, let's do it for a step out on the right. Open, set down, step out on the left. Open, set down. Nice work, you guys. Let's just go for some steps. So step the right foot outside, right hand. Switch, left foot outside, left hand. Switch, right foot, nice. And left foot, nice. One more each way. Last one, and then you're gonna hit your backside. We're gonna hit those glutes and get them nice and warm. So just roll right onto your backside right here. You can go double leg right here, lift and hover. Squeeze, 
Drive through the heels, squeeze at the top. You wanna engage it a little bit more. Go for the single leg bridge. Doesn't matter which leg, we'll switch in four. Nice. Three, option to switch your legs. Two and one, option to switch your legs. Drive right there, go for four. Nice work. Three, back to standing in two and one. Bring yourself up to a standing position. Anyway, you wanna get there, we're gonna take it to a lateral lunge. So you're gonna hit right, together, left, together. Hit right, together, left. Nice work. You're stepping out and you're driving off that bent leg, hitting those outer glutes, your glute med. Nice work. Take it out and out. Nice work. Go four. You're gonna give me high knees in three. Nice work. Two and one. High knees or marches. Get them up, get them up, get them up for eight. Seven, six, you got it. Five, four, three, two. Let's go for a little lateral push. Push right, push left, push right, push left, push side to side for eight, seven, six, you got it. Five, four, three, two, one. Are you feeling warm? Yes. Yeah. Are you feeling warm? <laughs> I'm feeling warm. Let's grab some water and jump in. Circuit one, squats and lunges. Love to love them, your staple moves. We're gonna get right into it with squats. Try and start heavy if you can. It is 30 seconds of squats. Holding one weight at each side. Option, you can hold one weight at your chest for a goblet squat. It's going right into squats, down up. And then we're gonna go into lunges and then we're gonna put it together, two and two. Girls ready to kick this thing off. Yeah. When in doubt, we say squat it out over here. Here we go, 30 seconds of squats. In three, two, let's go. So drop down, drive through the heel, stand tall. 30 seconds of squats. I'm driving through my heels to Sammy tall. I'm pushing my knees towards my outer three toes. Chest up, eyes up. Inhale down, exhale, push. Inhale down, exhale, push. One of the major cues I like to think about is not craning my neck. When we're going up into a sweat, we like to push ourselves. Our neck likes to go where we wanna go. Keep a nice neutral neck, nice neutral spine for five, four, three, two, and one. You can set them down. Take a quick break. We're just going right into step back lunges. Step back right, step back left. You're just gonna lunge it out. All right, stepping back, dropping the back knee towards the ground, driving through that front heel. Let's go there in three, two, step back right. Here we go, step back right, drive through the left heel. Nice. Step back and drive. Step back and drive. Trying to keep those shoulders still stacked over those hips. Nice strong front knee, not collapsing or caving in. Driving through that front heel using those nice strong legs. Nice, down up. Woo, 10 seconds. Nice, then we're gonna put it together with two squats and two lunges. Stick it for three, two, and one. Nice work. Now you're gonna give me two squats, step back right, step back left. Two squats, two lunges, put it together, combo move. Two squats, two lunges. Here we go, here we go. In three, two, let's go, let's go. Down, up, down. Step back right, step back right. Together, left, back to squats. Down, up, down. Step back right, right. Together, left, two and two. Nice, work. Shoulders are staying stacked over those hips, especially at the top of the movement. Nice, work driving through both heels in the squat. Driving through the front heel of the lunge. For three, two, and one. You can set the weights down, rest and recover. Take a break, back to the top. Squats, lunges, two and two. Rinse and repeat, you guys ready? Ready. Yeah. Rinse and repeat, let's do this. Squats, in three, two. Let's go now that we've done it once. All right, either of you can hit me with a fun fact of favorite part of working with pig farmers. It doesn't have to be a fun fact, just like truly, like what's your favorite part of working with the farmers on the front lines? I love working with pig farmers because it's a family business. And so I love the intergenerational aspect of it, right? That's so cool. You get to work with the dad and maybe his kids that are coming back and maybe grandpa hangs out sometimes, right? Three. <laughs> and they're two. Break. Family businesses, but they're just really genuine people. Nice. I love that. Like they genuinely, like we, like they care about the pigs. They care about their family. They care about the business. Very cool. I love it. Step back lunges in three, two, one. It's probably like one of the only, probably the largest intergenerational business you think model, right? Like oh yeah. Farms, 
Yeah, they're just passed down, right? You grew up on it. Yeah, you guys both grew up on farms, true? I did not. You did not. No, I married a pig farmer. You married a pig farmer. That's how you got your in. <laughs> that's how you got your in. And you grew up on a farm, Haley? I did. Okay, and that's what made you want to go to school for it? Yes, I grew up just loving them from the beginning. Nice, final three, two, one. You can set the weights down. I like to take a break. Whew. Give those hands a break. Two squats, two lunges, close out circuit one. Now we got a fun 30 seconds of power. Grab your weights, two squats, two lunges. In three, two, put it together. Come on, squat, squat, lunge, lunge. Nice work, team. Squat, squat, let's go. Lunge, lunge. Yes, yeah, strong legs right here. Boom, and boom. Nice. Keep pushing, 10 more seconds, 10 more seconds, and you're gonna drop those weights. You're gonna drop those weights, stay in it. Last five, four, three, two, one more squat, cause you can, woo! Nice work, guys. Weights are down, 30 seconds of power, if you choose. All right, low impact, squat taps, wide at the bottom, narrow at the top. You wanna take it to a full on jack, you can jack it. If you're with me, one lunge drop, one squat jack looks like this. Right, together, jack, together, left, together, jack, together. Pick your poison, what are you doing? Oh, definitely the squat jack tap. Squat jack tap, how about you, Haley? Yep. <laughs> She's in, squat jack tap. <laughs> they got squat jack tap, I got lunge drop, squat jack. It's your best 30, and it starts in three, two, let's go, right, together, squat, jack, left, together, squat, jack, nice. All right, we got Taylor and Haley in the background, wide at the bottom. <laughs> Narrow at the top, wide at the bottom, narrow at the top. Pick your level today and get after it. This is 30 seconds of power between circuits, meant to raise your heart rate. You got 10 left, 10 more seconds. Yes, you can. Final five, four, three, two, one. Way to yes. go, ladies. Way to go. Grab some water. Circuit two, we got deadlifts and curtsy lunges. Fun combo, you're gonna give me a staggered deadlift, then a curtsy lunge, so a little bit more unilateral. We'll work all right side first, all left side second. Woo! Try and go heavy again. We're gonna start on that staggered deadlift. Right foot forward, left toe popped, 30 seconds of a staggered deadlift. Hinge, 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 stand tall, okay? Driving through that front right heel. Working the front glute and hamstring. Front glute and hamstring, low back is turned on. Crush your oranges in your armpits. We go in two, that deadlift in three, two. Let's go, hinge, 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 hinge. Drive through that front heel. Good chance to catch your breath here. Good chance to go heavy. Love a good deadlift, good chance to go heavy. Soft bend in that front knee. Not fully locked out. Keep those weights close to the body. Start to feel this in your back. You can take the weights a little bit more suitcase style, which is off to the side or you can glide them right along the front of the legs. 10 seconds, 10 seconds, nice work guys. Stay in at five, four, three, two, and one, Woo. All right, now we're gonna go curtsy lunge. This right leg is gonna stay forward. Left leg is gonna wrap around. Gonna go, I like to think knee to calf or shin to calf, right into a tap, curtsy tap, 30 seconds. Right leg forward, left leg wraps in three, two, let's go. Curtsy, up, curtsy, up, so you're driving through that front right leg, right heel. We've had requests for curtsy lunges. I haven't built them into a lot of workouts, I'm not gonna lie, since recovering from my knee surgery. Starting to build that confidence up again. Woo! If you don't love the curtsy lunge, just give me a step back lunge or a split lunge. Nice work, guys. 10 seconds, stay with it, team. You got it. Five, four, three, two, and you're out. Now you're gonna put it together. One staggered deadlift, right foot stays forward, left toe popped right into one curtsy lunge. Left leg wraps around. One deadlift, one lunge. Let's knock out the right side so we can move on to the left in three, two, let's go. Hinge, 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 stand tall, wrap it and drop. Nice work. Hinge, 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 stand tall, wrap it and drop. Nice, so I'm thinking hamstrings and glutes. I'm thinking glutes and quads of that right leg. Majority of the work is in that right leg today, right now, in this circuit. We're gonna switch to the left, the next circuit through. 10 more seconds here, then we break and switch legs. Come on, come on, finish it. Last five, four, three, 
two, and your out. Weights are down. Woo, shake it out. Same thing, other side. Stagger deadlift. Left foot forward, right toe popped. I need a quick sip of water between. And then we're gonna jump in. I'm excited to hear a little bit more, Taylor, about what it's looked like. What, what has changed in the last four years? Okay, right foot forward, left toe popped. Stagger deadlift in three, two, one. So I, in my business, we're in the online space. Things are just like changing every day, right? I imagine that's not the case in the farm space, but you've been doing your job for how long? Four years. Four years. What has changed in those four years? Yeah. Or like a major change that I guess you've seen or shifts. Yeah, so I would say farming is a very volatile business, right? So one year you could have record-breaking profit. Right. And the next year you could have record-breaking losses. Three, two, and rest. We're gonna go into the curtsy lunge, so left look Left foot's gonna stay forward. Right leg is gonna wrap around this time. Right leg's gonna wrap around. Okay, I'll kick us off and then Taylor, you can finish your statement. All right, guys, grab those weights. We go in three, two, let's go, let's go. Curtsy lunge, drive through. Now it's all the work is in that left leg. All right, Taylor, what were you saying? Yeah, so it's just really volatile. And so every year is different. And so that's a lot of the changes that I've seen with pig farmers. Yeah. Um, and while every year is different, Every year is also the same, right? We build barns to last 30, 40, 50 years, right? So Yeah, that's true. We don't make change decisions lightly. That's true. That's true. It's expensive to make change decisions. <laughs> Three, two, one. Farming equipment is not cheap. We put it together. Two stagger deadlifts. I'm sorry, one stagger deadlift, one curtsy lunge. Left foot always stays forward. Right foot is going to do the moving. One stagger deadlift, one curtsy lunge. We go in three, two, let's go. Hinge, hinge, hinge. Stand up, wrap around for the curtsy. Nice, so chest comes parallel to the floor. Stand up, chest or shoulders stay stacked over hips. Bring it parallel, stand up, stay tall. Nice, hinge forward, and now stay nice and tall for me. There you go. Driving through that left front heel, you should feel that left glute really working for you throughout this sequence together. We got another fun power move coming for you. After this, guys, we're gonna drop those weights in five, four, three, two, and one, weights are down. Fun power move for you. Woo. This one is gonna be a glute burner. Okay, think speed skater, but think full curtsy. So instead of just pushing side to side, you're gonna give me a full curtsy. So full curtsy, tap down, big up and over. Full curtsy, tap down, big up and over. Right there, okay? Let's start. Right foot planted here. Left leg's gonna wrap around. Big up and over, push to your left side. It's only 30 seconds. See, I can do anything for 30 seconds. Yes, I can. We go in three, two, let's go. Curtsy tap, big up and over, big curtsy, big up and over, big curtsy, big up and over. Come on. It's 30 seconds. It's 30 seconds. I want that full curtsy each time. I want that full curtsy each time. Use those glutes. Come on, those big outer glutes. Nice. Woo, use them, use them. What do we call that? The hamstring, that's our ham. Yep. That's our ham on the pig. <laughs> All those ham sandwiches you're eating right there. Come on, let's five, four, three, two, and you're out. Nice work, Woo. girls. Nice. Woo. Moving on. Circuit three, lateral lunges. We haven't moved laterally yet. And calf raises, because we just don't do calf raises enough on leg day. I don't anyways. So I'm gonna start building them into workouts. Can I just say I love that, because I, Totally agree, but never do them in a million. Right. And you and make me. <laughs> yeah, and like I never do them on my own, really. And they're so good for runners. Think about all of this. Like every time you take off and like that quick twitch, fast twitch muscle, right there. Calf, really important for us. Really good for maintaining out ankle health, Achilles health, all that good stuff. So let's do it. Lateral lunge weighted calf raises. Let's go. Um, let's double up the weights. I'm gonna go two. You can always go one weight. You can hold one weight. We're gonna go lateral lunge to our right. So Lateral lunge, I'm gonna frame my foot. If you wanna hold one weight, it's gonna be in your left hand. If you wanna hold two weights, you're gonna frame your foot. Giant step out to the right, lateral lunge, 30 seconds. In three, two, one. All right, here we go, lateral lunge, drive off that bent knee, stand tall. Lateral lunge, drive off that bent knee, stand tall. A move, or what I like to think about on this is rib cage to thigh, rib cage to thigh, drive off that bent knee. Rib cage to thigh, drive off that bent knee. Nice, rib cage to thigh, boom. It's a little bit, this is my weaker side with my knee. It's a little bit harder. Really got to think about that power up. That's good strength training. Come on, five, four, three, two, 
and you're out. Now you're gonna stand here holding one weight at your chest or two at your side. We're gonna go calf raises, right? Lift to the toes, lower to the heels. With control, I want you to think about being able to do this with control. If you wanted to take it up to a staircase, get a little bit more range of motion, we go in three, two, let's go. Lift and lower. Drive with power, lower with control. Drive, control, drive, control, power. The control on the way down is hard, isn't it? <laughs> it's really easy to bottom out here. Don't bottom out. Drive with power, lower with control. Drive with power, lower with control. Nice. Again, like I said, if you wanted to add more range of motion, you can do this on the bottom stair of a staircase or some slight elevation to get that greater range of motion for four, three, two, and rest. Nice. Now you're gonna give me a lateral lunge with a pulse, so it's technically like a two count lateral lunge. Right, up, right, up, right into two, right there, all right? I'm gonna go one heavy weight, it's just gonna be easier for me today. All right, we go in three, two, let's go. Hit right, up, I did that wrong. <laughs> start over, start the timer over. I totally messed you guys up. We're gonna do it again. It is a two pulse lateral lunge into two calf raises in three. Two, one, I am human too. Down, up, down, top, lift, lift. Do it again. Down, up, down, top, lift, lift. Nice. Down, up, down, top. We need to sound the new move alert, the new, a new move. We have a new move horn that we sound. Usually when I'm with Rachel, new move, new move. Here it is. Up and up. One more time through it. Here we go. Down, up, down. Top, lift, and you're out. Nice work. Same thing, other side. Same thing, other side. So we're gonna go back to just lateral lunges, and then, then we'll do just calf raises, and then we'll put it together into that power move. Step left in three, two, let's go. Hit left, stand up tall. Okay, so we've talked about change over time. I know one thing that has changed over time is sustainability, right? Like pig farmers have made dramatic improvements over the past six decades of sustainability, right? Can you speak to that a little bit? Yeah, so we, we try to pick pigs every single year that are gonna be better and more efficient than the pigs we picked the year before because we know that the less resources that we use, three, two, and you're out. We'll let you keep talking. As soon as we get into those calf raises, I don't wanna cut you off, but no one wants to work longer than they have to, right? <laughs> okay, we're gonna go calf raises. And Dr. Taylor's gonna finish what she's saying in three, two, let's go calf raises, lift, lower with control. Go ahead, Dr. Taylor. Yeah, so we're thinking about that all the time because that's how family businesses are sustainable for the long term, right? right. Is by being sustainable for everybody who eats our pork. Um, something that we do on our farm at home is pig manure, AKA pig poop, makes really good fertilizer and it's really good for corn, which pigs eat. That's awesome, so, so it's like you, full circle, right? It's totally full circle, yes. Nice, you're here for four, three, two, and one. Nice, I'm gonna do the same thing I did on the other side. I love that, I love the full circle. It's fun to see like life full circle, like that. That is really cool. Um, and you had said something I wanna touch on. I think I heard you talking to the girls about this offset, and I was like, wait, what? That's really cool. Here we go, double pulse in three, two, let's go. So you're gonna hit left, up, left, two calf raises, up, down, up, double it up again. Left, up, left, nice. Two on the calf raise. Okay, did you say something along the lines of, if you are in Minnesota and um, you purchase pork, like there's a good chance you're purchasing locally and it's Minnesota pork, like why is that? Yeah, so Minnesota is the second biggest pig producing state in the US. Fun fact, yes. there it is, Dr. Taylor. Three, <sighs> two, one, nice work. I love it. We had so many people say, bring Dr. Taylor back. We love this workout. Nelly said, I love this workout. It was a super fun and it's super fun to see Dr. Taylor back because of those fun facts. Like I just love learning fun facts. I'm in. Okay, so it's Minnesota is what? The second largest? The second biggest and I was number one. So really. We're like neighbors. Yeah. Let's a little Minnesota flex, right? Yeah. A little Minnesota flex. I love it. Okay, you guys, we got a fun power move to do before we hit the mat for circuit four. Are you ready? It's 30 seconds of one, two, three, explode. One, two, three, explode. It's three lateral pushes, one explode. If you don't wanna to explode today, that's okay. Just give me a squat and a reach, okay? Three lateral pushes, one squat and reach or one explode. So we're all gonna start right. We're gonna push left, okay? It's 30 seconds, 30 seconds, chance to raise that heart rate. We go team, in three, two, let's go. Left, right, left, explode. Right, left, 
right, explode. Left, right, left, explode. 30 seconds, that explode is completely optional and up to you. You don't have to take it today. Take whatever level you're at today. If you wanna keep it low impact, you keep it low impact. Push, 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 10 seconds. Push, push, yes you can, yes, finish, strong. Right here, four, three, two, you're out. Nice work team. On the mat for circuit four, legs and core, legs and core. Oh no, we'll go to the mat, I messed that up. You got two squats, we're gonna start standing. <laughs> Sorry, it's gonna be a little up down today. Two squats, okay. Plank walk out, two cross body knee drives, legs and core, so I'm gonna go one, two. I'm gonna set my weights down. Walk out to a high plank, cross body, cross body. Walk it back in, pick up my weights, and go right back into squats. Two squats, two cross body knee drives. Sound fun? Absolutely. She's in. <laughs> She's in. Here we go. Two squats, in three, two, let's go. Down, up. Down, this time we're gonna drop them, nice and gently controlled. Walk up to that high plank, cross body, cross body. Walk it back in, find your weights, pick them up, two squats. One, two, this time we set them down with control. We walk out, we find that high plank, cross body, cross body, walk it back in. Find those weights, nice work guys. Here we go, one, two, set them down with control. We're gonna finish right here with two cross body knee drives, cross, cross. Nice work. From here, you're gonna drop right down to your knees. I'm gonna grab one weight. Doesn't matter. I'm gonna put it in my right hand, all right? It is a prisoner. Get up, down, back, back. I'm gonna lead with my right foot. Dumbbell right hand, three, two, let's go. Right foot, left foot. Stand up, drop, step back, step back. <laughs> right, left, up, take it down, back, back. It's the first to lead, the last to finish. Nice, here we go, a little tricky. If you don't like this, and the kneeling is like not your jam, that's okay. Just give me squats or lunges. Up, down, down, down. Three, two, and you're up. Nice work, we're gonna hit our backside. A little bit of glute bridge fun action to finish with. You can move my weights out of the way, sorry, I'm just gonna you're leave them right. there. You're good. Um, here we go. You have three glute bridge marches, three single leg bridges, one, Two, three, hold, go one, two, three. Three marches right into three single leg bridges. If you prefer double leg, just drop into that double leg bridge. So everybody lifts their hips nice and high. Option to hold the weight overhead. March, right leg comes up to a march in three, two, let's go. Right, left, hold right high, hold right high. Down, up, down, up. One more, back to march, here we go, left. Right, hold left high, hold left high, down, up, down, up. One more, hold it high, switch it out. Right, left, hold right high. Three, two, one. Making you think today, guys. <laughs> left, right, left, hold high. Three, two, and you're out. Nice work, team. Back to the top, back to the top. We take it back to our space. We got. Our dumbbells back here, already ready to go for us. Two squats, two squats, right into that plank walkout, two cross body knee drives. Finish strong today. Two squats, walk it out, two cross body knee drives. In three, two, let's go. Down, up, down. We set them down with control. Nice, I like it. Haley's got our body weight option for us today. Drive, drive, walk it back in. Find those weights if you got them. Here we go. One, two, Set them down, set them down, walk it out. Here we go, drive, drive, walk it in. Nice work, grab the weights. One, two, set them down with control, walk it out and finish with these two knee drives. Drive, drive, nice work. Option to grab that one weight if you want it. This time, hold the weight in your left hand, left leg leads for this get up, left leg leads. All right, we good? Ready. We go in three. Two, let's go. Left, right, stand tall, drop, right, left. Hey, see, second time's a charm. Crushing it, team. Crushing it, team. That time and tension, wow. Right, and, oh, I even did it wrong that time. And that uneven load, holding that weight on one side of the body, engaging that core in a fun new way. 
functional strength training. We love to love it here at NML. Five, four, three, two, you're out. Ooh. Ooh, back to glute bridges, team. Back to glute bridges, three marches, three marches, three single leg bridges. Three marches, three single leg bridges. It's this and your power move. Get those hips up and march on the right in three, two, let's go. Right, left, hold right, bridge for three, two, one, set it down, left, right, hold left high, three, two, one, switch, right, left, hold right high. This is another new move, we gotta sound that horn, 10 <laughs> seconds, nice work team, left, right, finish with three bridges on the left, hop, two, three, you're out. Ooh. Way to go team, way to go team. Who is ready for a bonus round? One last move, it's 30 seconds, gets your power move, and it's all body weight. You in? Yes. Okay, let me show you your modification. We are gonna bound forward. If you are not into that, here's your modification. Low, low, high, high. Front, front, back, back. Front, front, back, back. If you're with me, bound. Drop to bear, crawl back, crawl back. Get up, bound forward, bear crawl backwards. Yeah, it's your last 30 seconds. Let's do it together, team. Okay, you guys just wanna push those weights out of the way, you're yeah. making me nervous. <laughs> no one needs to twist an ankle on the dumbbell today. Agreed. Nice. Bound forward, bear crawl backwards. In three, two, let's go. Bound forward, hop to bear, step back. Two, three, nice. Work, Haley's got your option. I love it, Haley. Thanks for being our Rachel today with us. Rachel's usually our modifier. Great to have you with us. Nice work, team. Come on. Finish this workout nice and strong. You got this. Big moves today. Always moving and training like an athlete. Finish. Come on. Five, four, three, two, one. You are out of here. Woo. Way to go, Taylor. <laughs> Haley and Taylor. I'm just telling Taylor in all the other videos, you're on this side of me. Totally gonna mess me up. <laughs> I love it. Awesome nice job. Work. So proud of you guys. Thanks for joining us. Always fun to be joined by the Minnesota Pork Board. And we didn't talk about enough healthy recipes in this workout, but we've got an arm workout just like this in the same format, all arms. We share some of our favorite recipes in that workout. You can find that arm workout. We'll queue it up after this workout. But if you want more healthy, heart healthy pork recipes, you can find them at mnpork.com. mnpork.com. All right, thanks for the Minnesota Pork Board for sponsoring this. Awesome, Taylor. Awesome. Let's do a quick stretch. Standing stretches. Bouncing on my left leg, right heel comes to the glute. Nice quad stretch here. Feels so good, open up this quad. Way to go team, so proud of you guys. That was a solid strength leg day with a little bit of cardio sprinkled in just to raise the heart rate a little bit. My kind of leg day, I like it. Awesome job. I love the training like an athlete. I think you feel so strong and just like cool. Right? Yes. <laughs> like we all have, we all have, let's give ourselves a little knee hug. We all have this like inner athlete inside of us. You can pull it out to the side. Whether we like to admit it or not, we all like to be challenged a little bit. And like, as we get older, we start challenging ourselves less. Like, it's just something that naturally we start challenging ourselves less. So we're here to challenge you guys and make it fun. Big inhale up, big forward fold, stretch through those hamstring, opposite knee bends, plant the right hand on the ground, left arm's gonna go overhead, nice little side body twist, outer glute stretch, switch it out. Same thing, other side, twist and stretch. Bend the knees, roll up one vertebrae at a time, neck and shoulders last when you get to the top. Two big shoulder rolls up, back and down. That's your leg day. You crushed it. Way to go, team. We'll see you back on the mat for another workout soon. Thanks so much for crushing leg day with me. If you loved it, hit subscribe to our YouTube channel. And I've loaded up the arm version of this same workout right here for you to check out. Otherwise, check out our free at-home strength program in this playlist right here. Have a great day.